Welcome back to The Real Deal, and today I'm gonna list off the five things home buyers need to know when making an offer. When it comes to buying a house, you're looking for the perfect place to call home. The problem is, in today's market, there just aren't that many homes available to purchase. With inventory hovering near record lows and sky-high buyer demand, a multiple offer scenario is the new normal. Here are five things to keep in mind when you're ready to make an offer. One, know your numbers. Having a complete understanding of your budget and how much house you can afford is essential. That's why you should connect with a lender to get pre-approved for a loan early in the home buying process. Taking this step shows sellers you're serious qualified buyer and can give a competitive edge in a bidding war. Number two, brace for a fast pace. Today's market is dynamic and fast paced. According to the Realtors Confidence Index from the National Association of Realtors, the average home is on the market for just 17 days. That means from start to finish, a house for sale in today's climate is active for roughly two and a half weeks. A skilled agent will do everything they can to help you stay on top of every possible opportunity. And as soon as you find the right home for your needs, that agent will help you draft and submit the best offer as quickly as possible. Three, lean on a real estate professional. While home buying may seem like a whirlwind process to you, local real estate agents do this every day. And we know what works. An agent can help you consider what levers you can pull that might be enticing to a seller. Offering flexible rent back options to give the seller more time to move out. Also, your ability to do a quick close or make an offer that's not contingent on the sale of your current home is also attractive. It may seem simple, but catering to what the seller may need can help your offer stand out. Number four, make a strong but fair offer. Let's face it, we all love a good deal. In the past, offering at or near asking price was enough to make your offer appealing to sellers. In today's market, that's often not the case. According to Lawrence Young, Chief Economist at the National Association of Realtors, quote, for every listing, there are 5.1 offers. Half of the homes are being sold above list price. In such a competitive market, emotions and prices can run high. Use an agent as your trusted advisor to make a strong but fair offer based on the market value. Recent sales and demand. Number five, be a flexible negotiator. If you followed tip number three, you drafted the offer with the seller's needs in mind. That said, the seller may still counter with their own changes. Be prepared to amend your offer to include flexible move-in dates, a higher price, or minimal contingencies. Just remember, there are certain contingencies you don't want to forego. Freddie Mac explains, quote, resist the temptation to waive the inspection contingency, especially in a hot market, or if the home is being sold as is, which means the seller won't pay for repairs. Without an inspection contingency, you could be stuck with a contract on a house you can't afford to fix. Here's the bottom line, ladies and gents. When it's time to make an offer, it's important to consider not just what you need, but what the seller needs too. If you've got any questions on this subject, please give me a call, send me a message, whatever's easiest for you. That's all we've got time for on this episode of The Real Deal. So as always, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. We'll see you next week.